Hello and welcome to Red Blood Cell Roller Coaster. We're going to take you through the ride a typical red blood cell goes on every time it goes through the body. First, we'll start at the right atrium, the upper right chamber of the heart. It is used to pump deoxygenated blood from the body into the right ventricle. But before the blood reaches the right ventricle, it must go through the tricuspid valve. The tricuspid valve is there to prevent black flow of blood into the right atrium. After flowing through the tricuspid valve, the blood is then finally into the right ventricle. From there, it is pumped through the pulmonary valve into the pulmonary artery. The pulmonary semilunar valve is what controls the blood flow from the right ventricle through to the pulmonary artery. The pulmonary artery is the artery that delivers the blood from the right ventricle to the lungs. The lungs then oxygenate the blood. After being oxygenated, the blood is sent through the pulmonary vein into the left atrium the upper left chamber of the heart. The left atrium then takes the blood from the lungs and pumps it into the left ventricle. But before the blood can reach the left ventricle, it needs to go through the bicuspid valve that prevents the overfilling of the left ventricle. Once the blood reaches the left ventricle, it is then pumped throughout the body. The aortic semilunar valve is what controls the blood flow from the left atrium to the rest of the body. The aorta is the main artery that supplies the blood through the rest of the body. Coronary arteries are the arteries that supply blood to the heart itself. Arteries are what carries the blood throughout the body. Arterioles are the slightly smaller structures that connect arteries and capillaries. Capillaries are small arteries that deliver the blood straight to body tissues. Venules are small structures that connect capillaries to veins. Veins are the structures that deliver blood back to the heart from the body. Now we are nearing the end of our ride as we approach the superior and inferior vena cava. This is the structure that delivers blood straight back to the right atrium. Now we are right back where we started, and I hope you all enjoyed your ride on the Red Blood Cell Roller Coaster.